Hello everybody and welcome back to another installment of Fallout 4. I'm going to be playing the shit out of this game so I hope you're ready for it. So I just talked to this little robot chick here and she wants me to go check out on this farm because the water here is just ghastly. I unfortunately could not get the cam to activate in time so that you could actually hear my interaction with her but hopefully once I, I finish it I'll come back and I'll talk to her see what we can work out as far as getting this place uh, producing stuff that isn't so ghastly you see, about that water, see, you? see there there she is um, that was Bring you Supervisor Brown What are you offering exactly? It's two caps of pee. All right. Um, I thought he would actually be able to be a vendor, but apparently not. Okay, so. <clears throat> Um, I'll catch you up with what I've done. Um, the driving, yeah, is now a settlement under us. So, uh, there's apparently one person there right now. Um, they must have gotten there shortly after I left. I have no one here because I don't have a recruitment beacon set there. But I want to try and get, um sanctuary up before I start really putzing around with other places I did figure out how to get people to start um, tending the massive amounts of food that I put in there uh, because yeah as I just said attending so you have to actually go oh hey you go take care of the food instead of look there's just plants just eat so um, Sanctuary is on the rise right now. And for whatever reason, this just reminds me of Left 4 Dead. What the hell is this? And now, since I, I've got this mode of everywhere I go, um, I'm, I'm just used to going, Hey, let's scrap this and we can take it back. Beantown Brewery. And we'll come back because we're close to one of the objectives that we're supposed to go putz around with um, this game has become very unforgiving and realistic to a point um, you can't just roam around and one of the most important things that I have found to be in this game that you need is rat away because if you look down at my health, that little red piece that, I, that a few videos ago, I was like, it's just really, really little. Yeah, it was about that big, probably about a good 30% of my health. And the only way to get rid of it is to have rat away. So if you don't have it, you just consistently, hey. send you of course just tell me what you need help with there's a group of raiders that won't leave us alone stealing our food and supplies threatening us if we can't give them what they want we know where they're coming from but we can't stand up to them ourselves any idea how many raiders we're talking about no telling I'm afraid this time there were three but who knows how many are back at their base <laughs> She's just like, there's some people trying to, to mess up our shit. Um, go take care of them. Well, all right. Screw you, I'm taking the Tato. You 
years of academy training wasted. Oh, can't take mushrooms. I don't know why I can't take mushrooms. I'm a fun guy. <laughs> uh, I was never really this punny before. I, I mean, I kind of was, but... Good lord, not to like... Level 10. Shit. Alright, next level I am putting up my stealthings. There's some ass whooping going on. Oh, I'll catch up. This may hurt. There he is. Let's go, boy. We got ass to kick. So I find it interesting that they added the aspect in this game that you can actually have sort of like people with you um not just companions but just like hey these are my peeps leave them the hell alone or suffer the wrath of pickle bitches My dog, you son of a bitch. That's what you're attacking. Um, all right, what does this bunghole have? Nothing of import. Let's go kick some ass. 
Hmm. We're gonna do this shit bro style. Yeah, I'm here. I'd like to have a seat. Where's my waitress? Bang. Bang. Critical. There goes your head. <laughs> I need to start playing to my stats um, because I'm getting the shit kicked out of me. You guys are all upstairs except you. You are not. And I do like these separate armor pieces. Were you? Were you really? Right arm bones. First time I've ever seen a named typewriter. And open. I said and open. Yes. Oh ho, ho, ho. yes. Yes. You you were very, very acutely aware of just how awesome that was. Or maybe you were very aware. <laughs> Come on, tell me that's not awesome. Someone actually put a teddy bear with some eyeglasses, reading a newspaper, dropping a duke on the toilet. I can't pick that up. I can't. That's that's too awesome and adorable. <laughs> oh, Fallout and your funny shit. That's another thing about this series, if you're unfamiliar. They have a ton of Easter eggs in this game. Get him, boy. Get him. Get him. Get him. His ass. dog food can, can I just open it up and give it to him like he's, he's right here pack of duct tape Gwyneth Pilsner bottle bottle of capes ooh nice yeah so in case 
again, I will, I will, I will bring you up to speed as far as the Fallout lore. All of those little comic books, and they are comic books that you see, they give you permanent increases to your stats as you wander around and find them. Sort of a reward of damn master. It's a reward for you roaming around and finding different things. Um, you know, most of the time explorers just find um, Got it. Bam. That's all I gotta say. Most of the time explorers will just be in charge of okay, go here and scout this out. Okay, go here and scout this out. They don't really get much of anything. Well, in this game, they do. It's not just, hey, go out there, tell us what's up, come back, and then we'll go do the ass kicking. It's like, I go tell you what the hell is up, but I'll also let you know that I found out a good shit. And so they really just like you to explore and make more of the game rather than just, here's what the quest wants you to go do, go do it, and then you can go do whatever the hell you want to afterwards. This is more, all right, you went and found this, you've been paying attention, here's a reward. 5% permanent increase to your melee and unarmed damage. Shit anywhere you need to, boy. So where is everybody else that I killed? Oh, here's another one. Sorry, boy. That was my fault. You okay? Oh, apparently. things that you know people have taken their time to really put in hidden things in the game and it's I had a feeling that was coming soon we'll just drop that thing then I really need to find a place to sell I've got so much crap it's like here take this I just don't want to keep turning it into scrap because I can get steel and wood anywhere giggity oh boy what'd you find good boy good boy all right well I'm going to fast travel because I am not going to get my ass kicked. I took care of those raiders for you. Really? Well, that's the best news I've heard in a long time. By the way, we've talked about it. And we've decided to support the Minutemen. I think it's worth giving it another chance. The only way things will get better is if we stand together. Unification, y'all! Alright, so 
So I'm gonna go back to Garvey. Holy crap, that's awesome looking. took care of the raiders that were harassing that settlement you sent me to. The people there have decided to join our cause. That's great news. One day, we'll be strong enough to drive that scum out of the Commonwealth for good. As usual, I've got something else for you to look into. We can finally start to think about more than just survival. We've gotten big enough that we're having trouble communicating with all the settlements. It's a good problem to have, and I have a solution. I think it's time to retake the castle. It used to be the Men and Men HQ way before my time. Well fortified, centrally located, and most important, it has a powerful radio transmitter we can use to broadcast to the whole Commonwealth. So what happened to this castle if it was so well fortified? This was long before I joined up, but the story I heard was that some kind of monster came out of the sea and destroyed the fort. A lot of the leaders were killed in that battle, and I guess nobody ever felt it was worth the risk to try to retake it. I've always wondered if losing the radio station was the beginning of all our later problems. So, should I have an assault force assembled near the castle? I'll think about it and get back to you. Your call. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. A settlement has asked for our help. Apparently someone's been kidnapped. We've got to show people the Minutemen can really help them. Yeah, but dude... You're like, oh yeah, Minute Man. Oh yeah, Minute Man. Oh yeah, Minute Man. But look at it. We have five people here. Five. Can I even. Wait, hold on. It's under power. Miscellaneous. Okay, cool. I can put one here. Um, And we are gonna. Bam! No, 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 no. Um. Yeah, there we go. And then, hold on, can I do wire to there? And I do have enough copper. Alright. So that thing's powering up some shit. Death long conquered was bad news, huh, Mama? You telling me you killed a death claw with one bullet? Come on. What do you take me for? It's true. I might not look it, but back in the day, I had quite the shot. Yeah, or quite the imagination. Yeah. Alright, hold on. Can we establish one of these? Oh no, I can't yet. Wait, bed's five. Sweet, we got somebody in! Alright, hold on. Let me set you up with a bed. Yep, beds. Um, no, that's my house. Ain't none of y'all sleeping in my house. Here. Um. Got that bed, twisty turn. Build there. 
I'm gonna build a couple more because I'm hoping, hoping. That while I'm out doing my adventurings, hold on, Go away. Getting in the way of the door. I'm going back here though. Bam. Alright, there's beds for more. steel building up front that is just going to be nothing but hey, come here and sleep and live. You will enjoy it. Hooray, hooray, hurrah, hurrah. No! Open the damn door. Welcome to my little structure that I built. Bed. Ah. Bed. Ba. Bed. Ba. Bed. Ba. Bed. Ba. Bed. Ba. Bed. Bed. Alright, there we go. We got a ton of beds for people to show up in here. We got the recruitment beacon going. We got a defense turret. Um, we got food. Alright, hold on. Let's start it. Okay, no. You're already doing shit. Some days are harder than others. But even the hard days get easier than the one before. Um... Alright, hold on. I leveled. So let's take care of that. <laughs> um, where is... Oh yeah, there it is. Hell yes. Okay, so now we need to establish some of these other things that I can build now. We need... What was I looking at before that I wasn't able to build? Another ship for it. Build a terminal. Powered speaker. Um. No. No, I'm not gonna piss away copper on that crap. Power pylon. No. No, I think I know what I was going to do. This thing produces eight defense. Now I stick it up here. Oh, I can. 
Bam. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. Yeah, that's what it was. These. This is what I was wanting to do. Wood, bottle caps, and steel. Local leader rank two. Damn it. <sighs> that just looks like a mess of crap right now. But that's okay. It's uh it's working. It's coming together slowly. Slowly, but you know we're we're still a small settlement, just putting stuff together. There's a cooking station here. I can make noodle soup. Ooh! Ah! Come get get out! So, he's wanting to go take some shit. <laughs> there are other quests and crap that they're wanting me to go take care of. Crossings over there. Diamond City's down there. Okay. I'm gonna put a little pause in here. I just want you guys to get caught up on what I've been doing. Because you can kind of see where there's a little bit of small mundane crap going on. It's just really me trying to think what I want to do next. Where I want to go. How I want to help people. All that kind of crap. And I don't really think you guys want to see all that. Um, but I hope you are enjoying. And I will catch you on the next episode. Until then, like, subscribe, bring some friends, send some comments, do some suggestions. Let's do this shit. Don't forget about letting me know what you want weapons to be named. Remember to name it a weapon first and then what you want it to be called. Um, if you got to pause the previous video to see what the weapons are um so be it i'm probably gonna have new ones by the time all that crap rolls around so forgive me but we'll keep going with that whole little sp spiel theme thing um until next time 